This absolutely blows my mind. I never thought I'd see today that cops would actually protect American enemy terrorists. Now you'll notice that he's got his hand on his gun like I'm a real threat. He's known me for a long time. I'm a very peaceful person. Notice he's got an undercover car, not a regular cop car. He could very use that same car to go down to the Hathaway Bridge down there, Carl Gray Park, and this cop could take and get every one of these boom car punks that are putting ambulance and fire department people in danger, that are taking and putting the general population under a state of agitation at all times. I know the reason why this is done. This is done because the boom cars are play into the cops' hands of arresting people. God only knows the number of people that have been arrested and thrown in jail on bullshit charges. They don't even realize that this is a con game that's going on. <laughs> and so, um, I had this conversation with him, and he was trying his damnedest to try to push my buttons. Try to, try to trick me and everything like that. Well, you see, I just don't give myself credit for it. I thank my maker. If this is a planet of suffering, I would rather suffer knowing that I was trying to do something to protect people to make this a better world. So, this right here is an actual conversation that took place, I think it was uh, about December, I think it was uh, December 15th, if I'm not correct, uh, 2015. So, um, here it goes. This is the conversation right here of me only trying to plead for the protection of the lives of our ambulance and fire department people. Yes, as of uh, 328, December 12th, a broom car, kind of like maroon in color, probably down by uh, Michigan Avenue right now, came from east to west. I want him arrested. I want him thrown in jail. I want his vehicle taken away with 932 contraband. He's probably down, by the time that you, uh, officer gets out there, he'll probably be down there by the, uh, the Hathaway Bridge. I've seen this vehicle many times. I'd like to see if we can't get this, uh, this boom car punk arrested under 3015 of Florida statutes. I want his vehicle taken away under 932 contraband. All right, sir. Now, I want to know something. Do you all care if ambulance or fire department people die? What is the chances... Uh -huh. What? I'm not trying to go through this with you. Why are you even call if you don't think we're going to do anything about it? Well, what I don't understand... I'm not trying to do this with you tonight. I'm getting ready to disconnect. Now, we'll look for the car, but I'm not going to take this all night from you. Well, I'll tell you what. You you make it to us no more boom cars, and I won't call you no more. We got a deal? We got a okay, deal, or, or is that your... As we can, okay? Or, or is that one of your drug dealers? Yeah, is that one of your drug dealers? Right. Police yes, as of December 12, 2015, um, I am trying to report a, a, a loud car stereo, and every time I hear one, I'm going to call you. The Bay County Sheriff's Office. If you have an emergency or need a deputy's response, please press zero now. Wait while I answer your call. Is this the Bay County Sheriff's Department? Yes, it is. Can you speak up? I can hardly hear you. Yes, it is. I'd like to know something. I tried my damnedest as of December 12, 2015. A 
super loud car stereo was going from east to west, probably a, a drug dealer to go down there and sell so, so it. You swear this time to the perjury? Okay, sorry about that. Okay, miss, I am trying my damnedest to live in my home in peace on a nice Saturday, 3.30, December 12, 2015, and I was... There was this loud car stereo. It was uh, like a, a like a, a purplish red maroon metallic vehicle that came from um, from east going to west. When I called the Panama City Police Department, they could have very easily intersected him at uh, Michigan Avenue. But now he's probably down by Hathaway Bridge right now. Gonna go sell his drugs, cause I see the same vehicles going up and down the road all the time. I want him arrested. I want his vehicle taken away under 932 contraband. I want him arrested under 3015 of Florida statutes. I want him arrested under 80610, which is have a good putting... Day. You have reached the Bay County Sheriff's Office. If you have an emergency or need to wait while I transfer your call. Vacations, how can I help you? Yes, I'm calling the Bay County Sheriff's Department. I was trying to report a, uh, a loud car stereo in Panama City. As of uh, December 12, 2015, uh, through about 3, 3.30, and, and I, I don't understand this. I got hung up on the Bay County Sheriff's Department. Dude, I'm trying to protect our ambulance and fire department people from a horrible crash. Now, why can't I get any cooperation out of the Bay County Sheriff's Department? Okay, sir, what is it that you want? I want this vehicle intersected on the other side of Hathaway Bridge by the Bay County Sheriff's Department. I want him arrested under 3015 of Florida statutes. I want him arrested as American terrorist under 876 of the Florida statutes. I want him arrested for putting ambulance and fire department people in danger under 80610 of the Florida statutes. So, so nothing gets done, right? Yes, sir. Where's this vehicle at? Gee whiz! I'm in my home. I ain't got no wheels on my home. So are we are we playing the stalling guessing game? Is that what's going on? Okay, sir. If you can tell me where this vehicle is at, and what kind of vehicle, then we'll get a deputy out there to locate it. If you can't, then just call us back whenever you do. First of all, if the car is going down the road. And I'm in my home. How am I supposed to know where it's at? Okay, sir. Do you all care if ambulance or fire department people die because of a horrible crash? Do you all care? Jason Jeter, um, a boom car just went by about 10 minutes ago. I was trying to, uh, do you all care if an ambulance or fire department person dies because of a horrible crash? Don't you want to prevent that, Jason, my friend? Don't you want to prevent that? Ago. See, all they got to do, put an undercover car. I know you're undercover. Get out there at the Hathaway Bridge down there at uh, uh, where Call Gray Park is. Sit out there. Turn off. Turn off your radar gun because I know they use that for signaling. And get me one of these punks. Or do you, do you care? I know you just came to my place 2 o'clock. And I tried to get you to talk through the bathroom window, and all the cops have got to do is take out the no trespassing signs that are in the woods terrorizing homeless people and put on there at every traffic intersection. If we hear a boom car, we're taking it away forever under 932 contraband. What do you think about that? Well, first off, I, I don't go to anyone's bathroom. 
bathroom window to talk to him, Jim. So this way you're on to perjury. Under under perjury. In other words, if you're doing a stakeout and there is a drug dealer that's running out of a bathroom window, you no cop is ever there, right? Am I correct on that? No, Jim. You're, you're trying to blow everything out of proportion. But I said I wasn't going to come and talk to you at your bathroom window. Why not? I was standing at the front door right by where you were standing trying to record me the whole time. Yeah, yeah you know what? And when I record, I don't get you. I purposely don't get your permission. You know that? I've beaten cases against state's attorney with secret tape recording. I'll do my damnedest to record any of you all. Get you in your corruption. Damn, I will. I was standing in the middle of the parking lot. It's obvious that anybody can record me standing there. Hey, I'll do my damnedest if you're if you if you're raping young women in your home. I'll do my damnedest to secretly tape record you. How about that? At your home, if I knew where it was, take me up on it. If I'm doing what at my home? If you're committing a crime at your home, I'll do my damnedest to secretly tape record you. If I knew where you was at. Take that, take that, take that to redneck good old boy Glenn Hess, okay? And tell him where he can shove it. Now I want to know, Jason Jeter, why is it that you all will not protect our emergency vehicles, the ambulance and fire department people? I see them racing up and down the road. What is the chances of an ambulance? If you don't know that. I'm an emergency vehicle. What? Oh, then in other words, you, you, were, you were an emergency vehicle, but you will not protect yourself from these boom cars. And there's no satisfying you. So well, it's very simple. It's very, let me ask you something, Jason. What is the chances of an emergency vehicle fire ambulance? What's the chances of a boom car hearing them if they can, you can hear that sound half a mile away? What is the chances of them hearing them? I don't know the probability and the likelihood of that. What do you mean you don't? You ride a, you remember Bernie Wilburn? You remember the cop? Remember that cop, Bernie Wilburn? Bernie Wilburn used to be on the Panama City Police Department. Yeah, yes, I love him. That idiot clown in the year 2000.